What kind of freaking app is he using? It's pretty hilarious. You know what you should put on that soundboard? You should put that shit, um... Fuck. You know what? I don't have to answer to you. You ain't my bitch. Daddy <laughs> chill. The fact that I thought that was his actual voice. Bullshit. He just lost Bruh, shit. Suck my ass. Oh, 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 you're 11? Is that a real body? Is that a real- I can't tell if that's a soundboard or a real person. <laughs> MIND YOUR BUSINESS! Off target, no KIA. Um, I think you can use a bomb. Uh-oh. Mine! 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 We've got him on the ropes. Don't let you go now. And we know it! Switch inside! Dude, that shit sounds so target. clean, dude. You hear that shit? That shit does, bro. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. So today, I'm going to be showing you how to set up a soundboard. But just before I do that, if you guys can head over to my friend Pervy Gaming channel, he's actually been in all of my soundboard videos. He's actually the second soundboard that you hear play a lot of sounds as well. And he has his own channel. If you can check him out, I would greatly appreciate it. With all that out of the way, I'm just going to go ahead and jump into this. All the links that you're going to need for this are going to be in the description, as well as timestamps, because this is going to be set up in the segments. So the first segment is going to be voice mod. Link in the description. There is a pro version, and there also is a free version. For this, you only need the free version, you don't need the pro version, so don't worry about that, it's completely free. So you're going to go ahead and download this. Alright, once you have it downloaded, what you're going to want to do is go ahead and set up your microphone and your headset to it. Easy, right? And then, there's a pro tip here. Make sure these little things at the bottom are all turned off, or else you're going to get like voice changing effects, because this is also a voice changer. I never use it for that, um, but the voice changer is amazing. And then once you have that all set up, what you're going to want to do is go down here to your windows and then type in sound. And then what you're going to want to do is find change system sounds. And you're going to want to click that. And once you have this up, what you're going to want to do is go to recording. And you're going to want to find voice mod right here. Mine's down at the bottom. It says microphone and right below it says voice mod virtual audio device. What you're going to want to do is right click it. Oh, it doesn't show up here. So what you're going to want to do is right click it and set it as default device. And set as default communications device. Once you have that done, then that's going to be every time you talk in your mic that's what's going to be playing through which is what we want for this now that that's all set up we can move on to the next step and voice mod does have its own soundboard program i've never used it uh i've n <laughs> i haven't figured it out nor do i want to because i like the way i do it so the second segment is actually going to be Death Counter and Soundboard, which is another free program, link in the description, and this is what the link is going to take you to, is this little website here, and then what you're going to want to do is scroll all the way down where it says all versions and change log, and there's a bunch of different versions, I, I actually don't know which version I have, I know it's an older one, but it's not going to matter too much. Uh, 
they've only been fixing bugs and stuff like that. I should probably update mine because this is this is the, this is the biggest problem with mine. The audio delay, jeez. And once you have that downloaded, what you're gonna want to do is jump over here and open it up. Mine's in my little troll kit over here. And it's gonna take a second every time you open it up. Uh, there's a little delay when you click it, so don't keep clicking it because like a million of them will pop up at once. Uh, as you can see, I do not have the latest version, which I should probably download, but I'm too lazy. <laughs> Um, oh jeez, don't read these. Do not read the sounds. <laughs> okay, here's the thing. I never change the name of the sounds because I change them out so often and that's just too much work for me. But anyway, yours is not going to look like this. Yours is going to look more like this. So, this program is amazing. And this is why it's amazing. This is why I prefer it over any other free soundboard. I actually like to listen to the sounds as I play them. So what you're going to want to do is go to setting and then what you're going to want to do is go to sound. Now, make sure you keep overlap sounds on. That's so you can spam the sounds over and over again. So for your first output, you're going to want to select voice mod. And this is why we downloaded voice mod in the first place. So you can connect your soundboard to it. Uh, a lot of YouTubers will have you try to use voice meter. It's really confusing to use and it's a pain in the ass to set up. This is simple, easy, and it's it's amazing, honestly. Um, so as you can see, I use a blue snowball and blue snowball is nowhere to be found here. So that's why voice mod is very necessary to have. Once you connect it to voice mod, what you're going to do for your second one is set up your headphones. So now every time you play a sound, not only does it play through your mic, it plays through your headset. Alright, and then once you have all that done, you just press the X button. What you're going to want to do is go down here where it says add sound. And I'm for the sake of the video, I'm just going to call it test. Again, you don't have to name them. You don't have to name it at all. It really doesn't matter. Uh, and I'm just going to pick a random file and my files are all over the place. This is why I can't share my file with you guys. Because look, look at this, I have this random words that are just like inappropriate. <laughs> a lot of misspelling as well. That's <laughs> oh jeez. Alright, I'm just going to pick another one. I'm just going to pick a random sound. And once you have that all set up, make sure your volume's all the way up. And then what you're going to want to do is click here and just select the key. For this, the sake of the video, I'm just going to use Q. Like, screw it, right? Then just hit the X button, and then every time I hit Q, that sound should play. I'm about to go explosive on these motherfuckers! See? It's really easy. Um, like, it doesn't get any more easier than this. And you can just keep adding them, too. And then you can also make different presets. This is my Modern Warfare one. I don't know if I want to eat that or stick my wiener in it. <laughs> Uh, good times. Anyway, uh, so now that you have all that set up, you can you can play like that as is. That's the free way to do this. It's no voice meter, no VR, virtual cable bullshit. Super easy. Um, and I'm gonna go over where to get sounds, but before I do that, for the next segment, I'm gonna go over the non-free way to do that, and that's with a physical stream deck. So this is what a stream deck looks like. If you have any questions about it, this is what I use. It actually has exactly this one, and it is $150. Uh, in my opinion, it's 100% worth it if you plan on doing this a lot. And the main difference between using this and using the other program is that this can hold up to like a billion sounds. <laughs> so definitely worth the money. There are other ones. There's this cheap one here, um, but you don't get as many buttons. Uh, my friend Pervy, who I mentioned earlier, actually uses the XL, and I am so, so jealous. <laughs> and I'm just going to show you how to set up a stream deck, because again, no one on YouTube has a video about this. I don't know why. I had to figure it out on my own, and it took me... 
I wish I could just get those hours back. So I'm just gonna put it that way. I wish I could get that out those hours back. So what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and open your Stream Deck app. And again, don't look at this. I didn't when I <laughs> when I made this. I didn't think I was I was gonna be showing it to people. You know what I mean? So just don't pay attention to any of this. Um, but anyway, these are folders. And if I, you see, if I open it up a folder, a bunch of sounds pop up, and then there's another folder here at the bottom, and I can just keep going, and it's, that's how that works. Anyway, I'm going to show you how to set it up. So here on the side, there's a soundboard little icon thing. You're going to want to open that some bitch up, and what you're going to get, what you're going to be greeted with is play audio or stop audio. And I'm just going to go to a empty spot real quick. Um, so what you're gonna want to do is grab this play audio thing, just drag and drop. Super easy, right? Right? So down here at the volume, I like to turn that all the way up. So your output, you're gonna want to set that to voice mod. And it's gonna say line, and then in parentheses it's gonna say voice mod. Uh, virtual audio device, you know. Uh, so go ahead and click that. And then next what you're gonna want to do is select the file. Uh, it, oh god, alright, again, this is just gonna be a test, so I'm just gonna pick a random one. Alright, so now that you selected your sound, what you're gonna wanna do, because, again, I like to hear the sounds when I play them. So what you're gonna wanna do is right-click it, move to multi-action, and what you're gonna wanna do here is right-click this, copy, go down here with this big, nice, open space, for your dog to run around. <laughs> um, hit paste. And then what you're gonna wanna do for the second one that you have selected, go back down to output and hit headphones or whatever your headphone is, it doesn't matter. And then go ahead and back out. And so when you hit it, it should play through both. I can't tie my shoes, but I can fuck your bitch. Right. So it works, and then you can also name it, which is awesome. I'm just going to name it Test, whatever. Uh, you can actually change the color of it too, which is neat, super neat. I like to color code mine for certain, for certain situations and stuff like that. I don't know, you can do whatever you want, it really doesn't matter. But that's how that works, and that's how that's set up. Again, you're going to need voice mod. And, but once you have voice mod, everything should be okie dokie. So the last and final thing I'm gonna go over here is where to get sounds. Um, cause when you get started, it's really hard to get started cause there's so much you can do that it can be a little overwhelming and you can lose chain of thought a lot. So a good place to get started um, to get sounds is go ahead you can open up voice mod and when you go to the soundboard thing there's a click here button and this is the website you want again link in the description and there's plenty of sounds here, here comes the wow, 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 is very nice. so how this works is you just click a button of a sound you want to hear that was easy you know, and I'm gonna go ahead and find a sound that I like. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. I like this sound. Gotcha, bitch. And you actually have heard me use this sound many times in my video. So I'm gonna go ahead and download it. And how you download it, so right below it is the title. And what you're gonna wanna do is go ahead and click it. And if you scroll down a little bit, there's a download button. So go ahead and download that. So now that you have that downloaded, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to edit your sounds because that's just as equally as important. So once you have it downloaded, once you have it in a video editor or whatever editor you use, what you're gonna wanna do is make it loud. So the reason for this is in games, in a lot of modern games, uh, when it comes to voice audio, there's a little bit of a compressor, so it actually quiets you down a little bit. So the same thing's gonna happen 
to your sounds. It's going to be quiet down a little bit. So I like to make it really loud. What I like to do, I like to find that sweet spot of it being super loud and the audio not cracking. Because if the audio cracks, people can hear that. So I'm going to go ahead and play this. Gotcha, bitch! It can be louder than that. Um, gotcha, bitch! I think that's just about perfect. Uh, so that's about as loud as I make it. It's pretty loud. <laughs> gotcha, bitch! So again, when I play it through the soundboard, it's not going to be that loud to people. It's going to be about talking level to everybody else, which is very nice. So that's how the, you get started with that. And you can get sounds from anywhere, guys. Vines, TikToks, movies, you name it. You can clip anything nowadays. And that's how my soundboard works. Uh, I really hope that helped you guys. If it didn't, leave a comment. Maybe I'll do a follow-up video. Uh, there are a few things I left out of this video that I felt like that were self-explanatory. Maybe they weren't. I don't know. Let me know. And I just want to say a quick thank you to everybody who subscribed to my channel. Like, I really don't know why, but like a month ago, like less than a month ago, like my channel went from 60 subscribers to 1.46k. And it's because this video right here, this one, this is like blew up and I don't know why, but I am very grateful that you guys are here. And like, it's so funny too, cause like when I made this video, I was just like, maybe a hundred people will watch it. It's so crazy that it got up to 28k, like that's, that's nuts. And I just want to thank you guys. That's, that, that's, that's really awesome. Just one last thing before I go, I am going to try to make a upload schedule. Is just that I work a full-time job and my hours are kind of crazy so it's kind of hard for me to upload consistently but i'm going to try my best to and i i'm going to keep making soundboarding videos because not only do i enjoy making them it seems like you guys enjoy watching them so i'm going to be sticking with that for now and you know with the new call of duty around the corner things are even going to get better i guess hopefully so uh stick around and uh thanks for watching